Hey guys, Cell here. Welcome back to more Trails of Cold Steel 3. Now, it's time to do the conference room, but I really want to go and play that card game again with more people. Obviously. I don't think I'm going to be able to find anyone else here. Maybe. Possibly. Not yet. Though I do need to get a bunch of cards. That's going to cost a lot of money, so I might end up having to look up how to make money easily. I still got time before the briefing at three. It might be a good idea. Take care of any business I've got before then. I mean, do I have any more business? Did I? No, I don't. How does one look at their quest objective list again? I need quests. We've already done the package delivery. And we've battled. We've slain 45 enemies. So, all in all, not bad. Technically speaking, I guess I could fish. But I'm not. Oh, Vantage Masters. This is it. Okay, so cards owned. I have one out of seven masters. I have two out of seven magics. Two out of five nations. One out of five water nations. One out of five fire nations. And one out of five air nations. I've won two times so far and I've lost none so far. Which proves I'm currently on my way to being a master. So yeah, I'm really probably going to need to get new fighters. Well, masters in general. Okay, yeah, I'm done. As far as I know, there's nothing else here. Because I didn't see any green markers on my map either before we ended last episode. Eventually, Michael, Toa, Randolph, and Principal Aurelia arrived and... The briefing began at 3 p.m. as scheduled. Um, well, it's time. Are we starting this thing or what? Uh -huh, no need to rush. Not even I know the details of our special lessons. Only our chief instructor and our contact are pri privy to that information. I apologize for the wait. Our contact? Is it someone else from the OMP? Oh, I keep you guys waiting? Sorry, my bad. I just forgot huh? to lower the volume again. That voice! No way! Hey, Milim! And Major Lecter! His name was. And Matt! Ah, <laughs> oh, man, it's my favorite. A second favorite. <laughs> Milim! It's been a while. In terms of my favorites from the first game, it was Fee and then Milim. Sup, Breen? Long time no see! Sup? Oof! <laughs> And there's your traditional reunion tackle. <laughs> <laughs> Miriam Orion. 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 I knew tagging along with Lecter would be a good idea. I've got another mission next week, and I didn't know when I'd get the chance to see you again. Grats on graduating, Reen. <laughs> and grats on getting crazy tall, too. Thank well, you, I've only grown like five reach. Five reach. You don't seem like you've changed much. As energetic as ever, I see. I, I could have sworn they always called it Rege. Or was that just me? <laughs> hmm? <laughs> Milliam, it's been so long. Sheesh. Major Lecter Arundel. Been a while, Schwarzer. Didn't think I'd be running into you here. But hey, I'm glad the place you got tossed to is working out so well for you. Not quite sure I understand what you're getting at. But it's good to see you again. It's been since the end of last year, right? Right you are. A pleasure seeing you again too, Miss Herschel. The Major's not giving you a hard time, is he? Uh, oh no. We're all fine here. If we could get to the matter at hand, Major Arundel. And can't forget you. 
It's been a while since we saw each other, too. Hello, Orlando. I heard our leader asked you for quite the doozy of a favor. Sorry about that. <laughs> this isn't like you, Scarecrow. Yeah, it's a pain, but I still owe you one, so let's call it even, yeah? Well, that's a weight off my chest. Then that leaves... Oh, what's wrong, Ironblood? Oh, don't worry about me. Go ahead, continue with your reunions. Nope, I need to make an introduction now. Imperial Army Intelligence Division, Special Affairs, Major Lector Arundel. It's an honor to meet you. Oh, I suppose this is the first time we've met like this, isn't it? Though considering the events that led me here, it certainly doesn't feel like it. <sighs> <laughs> Thank you for your kind words. Wow! She's the Golden Rakshasa? Yep. Major Lecter's certainly formidable himself, but... Uh, I can feel the tension in the air. Anyway, let's get to the main topic. We seem to have Majors from both the RMP and Intelligence Agency here today. Now then, what sort of fascinating things will you tell us, I wonder? So, you added another voice cast that I need to try to do terrible voices for it. <laughs> this is... You see... Can't say I was expecting that, but not one bit. I'd call that textbook definition of a sacrificial pawn. So, whose organization was it that thought this up? Chief Instructor Michael... Uh, Major Arundel... It was the Intelligence Division, in conjunction with the RMP. Well, to be perfectly honest, it came from Chancellor Gilliath Osborne himself. Under the advisement of the Governor and General of the Crossbell, His Excellency Rufus Alberea. But, but this plan is just too much. There have been disturbances in the west half of the Empire. Multiple Jaeger Corps have been spotted as well as agents of society, Ouroboros. Thor's newly established branch campus will be tasked with handling these threats. These kids should start at school and you want to send them to engage in actual combat against threats like these. They're just being used as scapegoats, they'll die out there. Toa. She's absolutely right. However, this is one of the conditions that allowed for the establishment of this school in the first place. As I'm sure you're all aware, Tensions between the Empire and the Republic of Calvert have never been higher. Our entire eastern border sees skirmishes on a daily basis, but the other day a major battle took place in the Nord Highlands. The Nord! Ah, oh, crap. Um. Uh. Gaius. Hope he's doing good. But really? How things get so bad in the first place? To be perfectly honest. The Intelligence Division and the RMP are both completely tied up at the moment. We're fighting an information war along with the entire ease of the Empire, including Crossbell and North Umbria. Yep, pretty much. After this, I'm headed to the Quainson province, myself on my mission. I see. Is that something you should just blurt out? As a result of all this, resources and troops have to be diverted from the western half of the Empire. Thus, we are concerned there is a strong possibility we will be targeted for attack there. So that's where this plan comes into play. The mysterious society, Ouroboros, they were the ones pulling the strings during the Civil War, during the Northern War. They were the cause of the turmoil in Cospel and even the strange events in Liberal. In addition, the ten or so elite Jaeger Corps that, at times, work for the Boros have been spotted. According to our info at the Intelligence Division, all these groups appear to be on the move. This plan is necessary. We need to have some way to stop them. And of course, we will not be deploying the students to known lines of battle. We'll, while undertaking the, these field exercises, we sh would have the most advanced technology such as Panzer Soldats on hand to protect them. In addition, the branch campus will also receive its very own armored train for use in these exercises. An armored train? Isn't that a little overkill? Then had to cost the fortune. What I can say, we had a good budget. Besides, it won't be the only use for it. 
On top of all that, you've got the Ashen Chevalier, one of the best tacticians in Crossbell, and a former ca ace acting captain of the Courageous. Your students' lives will be in your hands, too. This is messed up. Now I understand. Quite an interesting plan. Training exercises that allow us to prepare for and deter an invisible threat. It could even be said it embodies both the world as a, a battlefield and foundation of the world philosophies of our school. Well. Thor's branch campus acknowledges the necessity for this plan. Now tell us where and when the first field exercise will be held. Understood. It'll take place in the south of the Sutherland province near St. Ark. Well, then where, when will it be Friday night? The when. I can't read, apparently. April 21st. You'll arrive there via the armor train, Durflinga. You finally going out on a little bit of an exercise? I'm ready to grind against enemies so I can get money so I can buy, you know, all my freaking uh, cards. I will become a master. I'll try not to have a losing streak. By which I mean if I lose, I might reset the game's last load and try again. I'll try to keep it as best as I can. Or I could just say screw it. And just keep battling. No, because if I lose, I lose cards, right? So I'd have to reload. Cause I don't want to lose my cards. That would suck. <sighs> I know there's nothing we can do ha could have done, but this whole thing still makes me feel bad. Yeah, I had no idea this was such a big operation. I feel like I showed up at a real bad time for you guys. Now it's not your fault, Milliam. It was all decided the m minute this campus was founded. Even I've noticed the western side of the Empire is looking a little thin. Yeah, but as someone from the Intelligence Division, I still feel kind of bad. If I'd known about this, it could have given you a heads up through uses or something. That probably wouldn't have been a great idea. I'm sure it was pretty confidential information. What, you're still here? <clears throat> Instructor Herschel. I'll need you to arrange our travel plans early next week. Understood. We heading home of any lecture? Not quite yet. I need to transfer over some info from the intelligence division. It'll take a little while. Find something to keep yourself busy in the meantime. So, essentially, I hang out with Milliam. I'm game. Actually, hey, Swanta. Think you can babysit for a bit. I'm down. Yeah, sure thing. Hey, <laughs> why are you treating me like so I'm some kid? And whatever, I guess it's fine as long as Rain is showing me around. Uh, no discipline at all. Just try not to cause any trouble understood. Well, see you later. Have fun. Oh, well, I'm off to the library to do some research. There are some documents I want to investigate for the field exercises. Oh, yeah. Well, don't work yourself too hard. He's right, Prince. You always go full throttle when it comes to stuff like this. You gotta take it easy sometimes. Well, I'll just try to be careful. Thanks, you too. See you later. If you need anything, please give me a call. Oh, I will. Don't worry. Hey, good for you. You get to work with the class Prince. Looks like she's working herself to the bone with everyone's requests as usual. <laughs> Yeah, pretty much. I've been relying on her, too. Hopefully she'll let me repay the favor. Anyway, how about I show you around the campus in the town? Oh, heck yeah. Let's get going. Received bonding points. I have one extra bonding point. So, I can't... Oh, hey, she's actually in the party. Wait, wait, how, how does one swap my party members? Woohoo! That's how. All right, I can run around as Milliam now. <laughs> so, I can talk to, oh crap, I have to choose between Toa and, um, don't worry, it's not like I totally forgot Yuna's name or anything. Totally not, totally not. <laughs> I'm a bad teacher. I mean, again, it has been a month. 
Oh, hey, so the one, the main thing we got to do is with Altina. But the side stuff we got to do is with Yuna and Otoa. I kind of want to max out Toa, but I'm going to try to get on Yuna's good side. So, you know, maybe she'll like me more. I mean, I got to get... I gotta get in good with my students, right? <laughs> Still very hard to control that. Huh. Ah, oh, shoot. Hmm, this is pretty hard. Hyuna, what are you up to out here? Uh, nothing. I'm just seeing how the racket felt to swing. Lu Louise is going to teach me how to play tennis later, so we can start a tennis club. Oh, tennis! I hear that's a popular sport in Remy Feria. You've got m m great motor skills, so that'll be perfect for you. Hmm. <laughs> Thanks, I guess. By the way, who's she? I've never seen her before. She's a cute little thing, isn't she? Are you helping her find her parents or something? <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, no, she's... Oh, are you one of the students? <laughs> nice to meet ya. My name's Milliam or Orion. Orion. I'm Tilly Spinks, and one of the veteran class seveners. Veteran class sevener, and Orion is... Seriously, who is she? Well, it'll take a while to explain everything. You seem busy, so I'll give you the whole story another time. Uh, okay then. Anyway, I need to get back to practice. See you later. Alright, here we go. We need to get at least the basic one down before we start our club stuff. Uh -huh, she's a hard worker, isn't she? Yes, yeah, seems like she's really into it. It'd be great if I could help out somehow. Yes. Oh, well, maybe that'd be a good way to help. Sorry, Million, but do you mind if we put a pause on our tour for a bit? Uh, sure, but wait, wait, are you? Uh -huh, typical Bean, I'm fine, I'm gonna help too. Thanks, Milliam. Huh. Huh. Ah. <laughs> I think I'm starting to get the hang of it. Okay, I'm all set for the club to start. I'll work hard with Jessica and Louise. Great job, Yuna. But what the? Instructor, you're still here. Wait, the tennis balls. <laughs> looks like you finally noticed. Now oh, there's another one over there, out of the way, coming through. <laughs> no way. Were you picking up after me the whole time? I was wondering why the basket wasn't running out of balls. You really didn't notice that at all. That's some serious concentration. I was watching you for a while. It's amazing how much better you got in such a short time. Just then me like the tennis club's off to a promising start. Now leave me alone. Gah, I don't want to have to owe you anything for this. You don't owe me a thing. I told you yesterday I was planning to help with your guys' club activities. Milliam helped out too. I only did what an instructor would be expected to do. Anyway, good job and good luck with the tennis club. If you run into any problems, just let me know. I'll come running, I promise. Ah. Uh. Hey, it's the one dude. At the towards the end of the game, after that giant tower climb. I got to see a little bit of what uh he and that one idol was capable of. I forget their names. There's still many barriers between Crossbell and its future, but we will overcome them. Yuna, I want you to fight and struggle to overcome your own barriers too. And if anything happens, I'll come running, I promise. But why does he have to remind me of him? There's uh, something wrong. Uh, it's nothing. Oh, whatever. Whether or not I call you for help, I plan to give the club everything I've got. And thanks for picking up the balls. Ah, uh, you're welcome. Oh, you two. Uh -huh. I didn't know what's going on, but you two seem closer all of a sudden. William, what the... Uh, that's not. <laughs> she doesn't know when to not bring it up. <laughs> Afterwards, they all helped put the balls back in the storehouse. Your bond with Yuna strengthened. 
Oh wow, I only got half a star for that? Man, she's hard to please. Dang. At least Musa got a little bit past half of a star. Okay, well that's the only bonding point I had. So, Altina is at the bakery right now. Wait. Wait, Trista Radio has a... Oh. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. I actually legitimately have to keep running around. Well, you know, I could just hit my map and do that. Okay. So, yeah. I ended up... Re I ended up accidentally skipping dialogue on someone's stuff. <laughs> Then I didn't save the game, so I guess it's a good thing I didn't save the game because I found out about the whole, you know, hitting down while I'm on the map that I can see green markers. So now we're back in the past before the conference, before meeting Milliam. I'm gonna have to go do the other stuff again. But hey, at least now we get to go talk to Gina because she was the last thing we needed to do before the conference. What should I do? What if some hungry students come by? What's wrong, Gina? I'm in to bean. I'm running out of certain spice that I need for my recipes. I noticed me a number of students that would come on the day off. Aha, uh -huh, well, free day isn't quite a day off. I'm pretty sure it's st still it'll be a busy day for the clubs in the cafeteria. I see, I completely misunderstood. What should I do at this rate? I'll run out of food by the afternoon. I can't just leave to get more. She is helping out at the school. I want to help her back, but... I'm gonna help. Is there anything I can do to help? I'm on patrol right now, so I should be able to find some stuff for you. Oh, really? That would be great. Can you go grab the spice for me? It's called Star Anise, and it's kind of rare. We use it at... We use it at tavern. My father should be there now. Can you ask him to give us some? Understood. I'll go visit him. And there's an actual next side quest. See, I, I, sh I should have looked, but I obviously didn't. Hello there, Barney. Hello! Oh, Mr. Ashton Chevalier. Thank you for visiting our store. What would you like today? I'm actually not here to eat this time. Rain explained that Gina had asked him to come get some star anise. Oh, I see. Sorry about that. Thanks for coming. Please, wait one moment, I'll go get it for you. Star Anise. You out? Yep. I missed a body. I need to go to get, buy, some, buy it from somewhere? But sorry, looks like I'm all out too. A cro whole crowd of students came in earlier today. Looks like we ran out. I see. It's the same all over town. Do you happen to know where I could get some? You should be able to get some at Neo Suiyan, but you shouldn't have to. Uh, I don't mind. I'm already here, so it's only on my way. Oh, is that so? I see. Thank you, and my apologies. No problem. I'll head over to Neo Suiyan. Alright. Neo Suiyan. I ain't walking. You crazy? Oh, what brings you in, instructor? Well, I'm looking for some star anise. We ain't told the old man, man Rod the situation. Oh, I see. So you've been put through the old runaround here. Yeah. I've got some star anise. The spice is prevalent in the east, so I've been promoting it here in leaves. I see. Until coming here, I've only I only, had only heard of it. It's a good ingredient for soups, and it helps improve your circulation. We've got plenty in stock, so take these with you. Great Bean received two bags of Star Anise. Thank you. So we got one for the school and the other for the tavern. Exactly. Now, you wouldn't mind dropping them off, would you? No, I mean, that was my job to begin with. Bean was asked to go to the tavern and then to the cafeteria. Oh, I see. Sorry for making you go out of your way like that. It's no problem, really. Here you go. Use all you need. Bean gave Gina the bag of spices. Oh, you're a lifesaver. Now I can get back to cooking. I was really worried that I would run out. It would have been an absolute disaster if I couldn't feed everyone. Makes sense. Something like that just wouldn't fly working in a tavern. 
The students are still growing, so it might be best to have some extra in stock just in case. Of course, I'll make sure this doesn't happen again. Oh, and before you go, a little something for all your trouble. Spirit incense. Are you sure I can have this? Please, I insist. Thanks for all your help today, instructor. Likewise, I'm looking forward to trying more of your cooking. Alright, now I've done every single thing, so I shall be right back on the roof of the school where I was going to go talk to someone, but I accidentally, you know, hit a skip button on my keyboard that I didn't know was a skip button, and yeah, that sucked. Alright, here's the guy I was going to talk to, but then I accidentally hit the button. Oh no, oh no, it's already evening. I'm gu gonna end up on the student council at this rate. What are you annoying about? Oh, Instructor Reed. And who are you? I am Millie. I'm one of Reed's classmates. I'm just showing her around the campus. By the way, if you need some advice, I'd be happy to help. Looks like you're having some trouble choosing a club. Really? You have my savior. Please, she's a hard. Why geez? Don't, don't you mean give? How does this dialect change from G give to G's? Hmm, you're gonna pick your clam, shouldn't that be fun? On well, right now, I've got a, I've no got a Scooby. I don't got an idea? I've got to start all over for a Scotty one. How do you mean? Well, I've actually got a wee bit of a reputation for being pure in tide change in railways. Wanted to start a railway club, but couldn't I find anyone else to join? I was running out of time, so I went to aid Ty, this principal, to ask if I could start a club by myself. Did not take long to shoot me down and tell me I'm a boy and guy, though. But really? Hi, she started G, G and it, it all this about boot our club activities are for demonstrating the composure of a citizen of the Empire. Now will you accomplish that sitting around doing something you're already skilled at, she says to me. Oh yeah, that definitely sounds like her. But if you don't want to end up in the student council, you need to come up with an alternative. Oh, pick me, me, and pick me. What about the cooking club? That's what I did, and it was super fun. You get to eat a bunch of yummy stuff, too. Ah, uh, that does not sound half bad, actually. Now that you mention it, I hear Sandy starting up a cooking club. Then again, it, I, I, I'd pop, b probably be more keen on eating the food than cooking it. Hmm, that's no good, then. I'm sure there are a lot of other available clubs too, right? You didn't want to join any of those. I well, I don't really fancy any of the other clubs, to be honest. None of them really sing to my heart the same way trains do. Hmm, I see. Yeah, that makes me think of our performance for the school festival. We really sing our hearts out there. I can picture the stage like it was yesterday. Yeah, me too. Oh, what do you do for your school festival? All of us in the old Class 7 did a musical performance. We dressed up and played some rock music. Uh, uh what? Uh, uh, what? R really? <laughs> I like how that's the only thing that's voiced. <laughs> uh, uh, what? Oh, man. Playing rock music sounds pure dead badass. Eh, <laughs> right? You seem pretty fired up about that. That's interested in rock music, Pablo. Oh, yeah, I listened to it quite a bit. Those sounds like that shake your soul like a certain wave, yet feel familiar and nostalgic too. Just like the sound of a train chucking along the tracks. Aha, it seems the thing about you being a train nut was an exaggeration. You do have something else you're interested in besides trains. Hmm. But, but don't the music clubs have to be like orchestras and the like? Not necessarily. Other schools might require that, but here at the branch campus the clubs are left mostly to the students. You can make it more of a modern music club if you start looking now. You might be able to get some more members. Huh. A modern music club sounds pretty interesting. Heck yeah, it sounds super cool. Alright then, time to get moving. I've got till the end of the day. I'm gonna, gonna go around asking everyone if they want to join. Cheers for the help, Inspector Reed and Miss Milliam was it. Glad to help. <laughs> no pub, and you don't miss the miss part. Don't need the miss part. But will Pablo be able to find anyone on his own this late in the day? Help? Think about it. Help him. But do you mind if I gave you a hand? 
It's so many evening, and you, you'd be able to get to more people if there's two of us looking. Yeah, sure. That'd be a massive help. Of course, I might as well as see this through to the end. Now that that's decided, how should we spread out? The campus is pretty big, so still leave that to me. I can, can ask around at the dorm later, so could you check the town for me? Ah, uh -huh, can do. All right, you let's go, go, go. Band campus quest, getting the band together started. All right. Alright, I'm gonna look around the campus. Would you mind looking around town? No problem. <laughs> I'll see you later. Character note entry Pablo. Alright, now we gotta go look through town. Go to the station square. Anything show up? Yeah, right in the middle. And then Radio Trista is what we gotta do next. Hello there. Valerie, you seem like someone who would like rock music. Huh, it's already evening. What am I going to do? There's Valerie from Class 9. I wonder if she's chosen a club yet. Well, let's ask. Hello there, Valerie. Do you ha have a moment? Instructor Schweizer. Eh? And who in the world is that? <laughs> yeah, I should have seen that coming. I see, a modern music club, huh? Pablo is desperate for the members, so sh I should join, is that it? Wasn't that kind of you, instructor? If you don't want to join, that's perfectly fine, too. If you're considering another club, then too bad for Pablo. I'd be more than happy to give you advice either way. If it's too difficult to ask the guys, I can do it for you. Well, no, it's not like that. Hum, if you want to do it, then you should just jump in already. Now, now, Milliam. Well, I mean, I am a little bit interested. Oh, yeah. Check this one, Have you heard of Northern Rock? Well, just the name. It's popu popular in Remiferia, North Umbria, and Jurai. Pretty much the whole north region of Western Zemuria. It's a specific subgenre of rock, right? I'm a little familiar with rock, but not enough to know about any trends in it. He would have known, though, being from Jurai. Are you a fan of it? Well, somewhat. And I can also play guitar a little. Really now? Sounds like we've got a match then. Yep, yep, it's decided. I suppose it might be more interesting than the student council. I guess I could go talk to him about it. Sounds good. Hmm, if I had to guess, I'd say Pablo is just about done going around the campus by now. I'll give him a call on my August 2. Pablo told them he'd also been able to find a few prospective club members across campus. He decided to gather everyone together in the main building's rooftop. Ah, so Pablo already asked you, Gustav. Are you interested in rock music too? Yeah, I'm from near the Aragon mines, so North Umbria and Jirai are practically our neighbors. I'm not sure if it's, that's the reason why, but I grew up surrounded by people who were fans of Northern Rock. That said, I'm a total novice when it comes to instruments. Well, learning that is part of the club experience. By the way, you can play any instruments. Can you play any instruments, Pablo? Can I say I've got any experience? But I'm pretty good with my hands. Should be no bother. I think I'll ask someone with some sh experience to show us the ropes, though. I didn't say I join yet. Ah, oh, I take it you're fine. We're joining the student council then. And no. Uh -huh. Then you'll just have to suck it up and gee it to bash. I'll do my best not to bother you. Uh, I guess I've got no choice. Very well, I joined the modern music club. Ah, uh -huh, then it's decided. Hey, fun fact, Twain's played guitar before. So if you need some tips, go and fuck him anytime. Oh gee, thanks, William. Oh yeah, guess we can ask for a cheeky bit of help now and then. Ah, uh -huh, well, I don't know how much help I can be, but I'll see what I can do. Anyway, here's to the start of the modern music oh, club. Oh, thanks, lords. Again, why does he... Why does he have voice dialogue for that, but not for anything else? Cheers to the party for helping you. Okay. Well, that's their character notes. Anything else? I won't really be able to tell unless I go to the front entrance. 
That's what I wish I would have done before, but I didn't. Okay, nothing here. Oh, Vane. Is that Milham you've got there with you? It's been quite a while, hasn't it? Eh-heh, <laughs> about a year or so, yeah. You look better than ever, Monk. You even seem a bit happier. <laughs> well, I have been getting out more since I started working here. Anyhow, V, you seem to be getting around a lot, just like when you were a student. Are you planning on taking your class or anywhere outside leaves? Uh, well, actually. Vane told Monk about the field exercises. So now the entire band campus is doing what only you guys in Class 70 used to do. I'm looking forward to all the good stories I'll be able to tell on the radio. Oh, that's right. You always re reference our exploits in the old Class 7 in your radio material. <laughs> yeah, though I, I'd always add my own little twist to all your little escapades. But I'm bummed that I can't really interview the students. Unless certain someone would be willing to provide me with a story. What are you trying to say? That you want to ask Green? I guess you could say that. I know you're going to be working, so I shouldn't be asking you this, but if you could give me some good material to work with, my job would be a lot easier. Can you help me spice things up at Radio Trista? In that case, sure. Should I contact you through the Orcus when I have new material? Yeah, that'd be great. Thanks, Reed. Uh, nothing like having friends to help you out. Wowie, Monk. You've gotten pretty good at negotiating. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> Anybody here want to play cards? No? Okay. Alright, Milliam, you get to see old Tina. It's been quite a while since you two have seen each other, I believe. What are you doing here, Altina? I am recovering my energy by supplementing my sugar intake. Today was fairly tiring. But I'm proud of you for picking a club. I'll be have fun swimming with Leonora and the others. Well, it won't be official until the school approves it. I'm just glad you were able to make a decision. Oh, you're gonna be in a club? Okay, I'll cheer you on too. I will try to persevere as long as I can. How was your brief? <laughs> that voice. Hey, Tilly. How you been? What is she doing here? Now, now, Altina. She's just here on business. I was giving her a tour of the, around the city. Altina, see, Tilly. Last time I saw you was that joint mission last year. How's Sammy doing? Yes, it has been a while. And can you stop calling me Tilly? But, but, your name's kinda hard to say, you know. Uh, how is Altina hard to say? I'd say Milliam is harder to say than Altina, but sure. You can call it Millie and Lamy. I will not. And I never accepted your name for Clown Solaeus. <laughs> but it's easier to remember. Well, Millie seems happy at least. I heard they did some missions together last year. Hello, this is Ray. You don't need to tell me your name. I know who I call. I mean, this Professor Speed. Now that the briefing is over, you must have some free time. Prepare yourself and come to Iron Hell Keep. Iron Hell Keep, for my orienteering exercise. I'm sorry, but I'm giving I'm giving an acquaintance a tour right now. A child from the intelligence division, perfect. Bring her with you. Come here the moment you're ready. Don't keep me waiting. Uh, he hung up. He's demanding as always. What's it mean? That call. Uh, I, I don't really know, but... Green told Milliam about Schmidt's call. Oh, that place sounds fun. So should we get going? Are you sure, Milliam? What about the tour? <laughs> That's fine. I already got to see Tilly. I want to see old man Schmidt too. Well, he did make it seem like it's important. Alright, then once we're ready... I will accompany you. Hell yeah, alright, let's go. The, uh... Uh, what... What, what were the, uh... Things called? 
What's Clomsalaeus's like actual name? Like what is it? I forget. Huh. He said the child from the intelligence division. That could refer to me as well. Besides, you didn't specify the number of people. Ahead, <laughs> sounds good. Let's go, let's go. Millie and Tilly, Lummy and Sammy. We're the ultimate quartet. Please don't affiliate me with you. Huh, now now you too. Once I'm ready to go to the keep, I'll come talk to you. You still have some pancakes to work through, so take your time. Minister, I shall proceed to stand by. Join Altina and head to the keep to advance the main story. Please note that once you do any bonding events, quests, and sub-events for the current day will disappear. I mean... Unless more quests popped up, I'm done, right? Uh, nothing here? I don't think I'm that blind that I would miss something now. Alright, let's go. I will wait here. Please instruct me when you are heading to Iron Hell Keep. I should be thoroughly prepared. Is there anything I forgot to do? General Tiana and head to the keep to advance the main story. Please note the bunny and quest. Yeah, I know you told me already. Head to the keep. Understood. I shall clean up these pancakes post haste. <laughs> Why don't I help you? I can handle this myself. Well, oh, you're so stingy and chilly. Uh -huh, Altina, you don't need to hurry, okay? After that, Altina unwillingly shared her pancakes with Milliam. <laughs> and the three of them headed to the keep. So, you gonna make me, like, practice again through the first floor? Hello, Instructor Reen. Hello there, Tina. Sorry I'm a bit late. Hey, old man Schmidt. It's been a while. How you been? As always, you're an insufferable little child. And stop calling me Grandpa. I see the Black Rabbit is with you as well. Yes, is there a problem? No, it should not impact the results of the test significantly. If anything, we can raise the level now. Let's get to, right to the reason you called us. Seeing that Tina's here, I can hazard a guess. Uh huh. It's probably exactly what you think. Let's cut to the chase then. Follow me. Hey, we are going to floor one. Wait, so I get to uh, team up with Altina and Milliam in this exercise? So, no one else? My students aren't coming along? Oh, so this is what it's like inside. I've already been here doing an orienteering exercise. Oh, so they made you do this, huh? So you wanted to continue with the trials. Is that what you were hinting at? Precisely. Earlier this month, you experienced level zero. Today, you'll be entering level one. This trial is calibrated to more closely match the rigors of actual combat. If you ever think it'll be as easy as last time, you'll leave this place as a dead man. Last time we had a magic night. That was the easy one. Oh, it sounds like a blast. Oh, hold on a second. Don't you think you're going a bit too far with this? Participation in these trials is not mandatory. However, one of the conditions of my work for working here was that the Ocean Chevalier would participate in my experiments. So if you, so if you choose not to participate, there's no further reason for me to remain at this school. Ugh. Uh, that's super selfish. Uh, but Professor, we still have the pants of salt diet chaining. If you leave... Oh, not my problem. I know about the special lessons. Would it not be beneficial to practice the Arcus 2's new functions here now? Uh. Hmm. He's got a point. It's probably better to be prepared, you know. Don't worry, Fane. We'll be fine after all. You got me with you. Is that right, Tilly? <laughs> no idea, however. There is no reason for me not to participate, so I shall. I'm Felicis to support Instructor Reed. William, Altina! Okay, we'll do your trial. Please, let me your strength, both of you. You betcha. Understood. Huh, what a waste of time. I'll go prepare the trial now. There's an elevator in the back. Use it to reach the starting point. If you need anything on the Arcus 2 suggested, please let me know before you go. No, I don't need anything. 
I mean, I could end the episode now, but I kind of want to at least get to the point where I can grind, you know, a bit. You know, I don't really think I'll need to grind until we actually are on the field of battle. Wait, hold on. In terms of our party, Altina's the lowest out of everyone here. Milliam's literally our level. Okay. So... I shall go. Looks like the control panel operates the elevator. Brings me back to the time we spent our way through the old schoolhouse. Fighting. I'm real happy I get to do this kind of thing with you again, Fane. Happy. Aha, uh -huh, I guess that's one way to look at it. Alright, let's get ready and then move out. Woohoo! And it's dead. But see, Aldina doesn't really understand the whole concept of being happy and everything else. Unlike Milli Milliam, who does. She'll learn, eventually. So, yeah, I have to, I have to hit it. Starts keep level 1. So how many times can I come back here? Can I get out and grind, then buy some materials, come back and grind, that sort of deal? Or is it a one-off thing? I'd like to think you could. Well, so this is what it looks like inside. We went up. Yeah, we sat in an underground last time. Okay, so that's a locked system right there. I inhale keep level one. Seems like the entire in internal structure is completely different now. I remember hearing that there were mechanisms to change things around in here, but I didn't expect it to be this drastically different. Well, it all means me, it's pretty badass. And Tim is saying to check this place out. As in the previous trial, your goal will be to reach the feathers point. Use the Divine Knights is, is still prohibited. I recommend you don't let your guard down. I'll do my best to help you navigate again. Good luck to all of you. Got it. Millie and Altina, get ready. Lammy. Climb Salais. Oh yeah. Oh, good to love. Clum Slayers. Good to have you both with us. Let's go. Our exploration of Iron Hell Keep, level 1, starts now. Tell you how, let's get at it. Let's finish as swiftly as possible. You say as swiftly as possible, but... By the way, Tilly, are you able to use orders? I know how to use them, but have not yet tried. Since this is a good opportunity, perhaps I will test the function now. In that case, maybe I'll let my loose with mine, too. Altina's order, Ebon Crest, is now available. William's order, White Decoration, is now available. Aha! Uh -huh. Looks like they're both fired up. Can't let myself get left behind. The eight leaves one blade second form. Gale. It's been a while, but maybe I'll dust it off now. Alright. Beginning search. So, here's my, here's my heal points. Oh, oh yeah, I can save uh, here. Completely forgot that I can actually save in the midst of combat now. Don't remember if you could originally do that or not. Wait, what's two charges? Huh. <laughs> gotcha. All right. Detector, Bionic. Yeah. Let's go! Yeah! Now! An opening! This is the end! Woohoo! Yeah! It's my turn! Yeah! It's down! An opening! And goodbye. Thank you. <laughs> that was perfect! Thanks for the assist. Not bad. That way is blocked. Crackstone pillar. Please, lead it to Clum Slayers. I'm sure it can easily destroy this obstacle. And don't forget about Lamy too. Certain objects on the field, such as cracked pillars, can be destroyed by a field attack from a character whose weapon strike rating is A or higher. Will do. There. 
Pillars eliminated. We may now continue. That we may. There. <laughs> glad I have you. Take them down. Hell yeah, we're glad we have them here. Yeah. Here I go. Ha! My turn. There. <laughs> it's my turn. Sit. I'm a. Ha! My turn. I just it's my to attack sit. normally, right? <laughs> here I go. Never mind. I'm poisoned. Get lasered! I'm up! Ha! And battle's over. Hopefully poison actually <sighs> disappears. Everyone okay? Yeah, it does. Crap. There. Shutters! A few of them, actually. And try and find yeah. a way to roll them back up. We have the advantage. We will. Don't worry about that. Ooh, Gale! Second form, Gale! Oh, of it's course down. he missed. An opening. I should have rushed. Woohoo! Get lasered! Got him! Rush! We let's do this! Leave it to me! Yeah. Oh, I'm connected a million right now. I thought I was connected to all I should go. I'll connect yeah. myself after the battle's over. Uh, that bastard just attacked Altina. Uh, bastard. It's my turn. Do I have to heal? Ooh, seven slash fallen leaves. I can do my ultimate. Eh, arts. Hey, Les. Arcus, activate. Yeah. Thank you. And back to full health. Take them out, please. Get lasered! My turn. Yeah. And we win. Battle complete. Let's continue. Not bad. But yeah, I don't really see a point to grinding these guys right now. So we have to go this way to lift up the shutters. Eh. Treasure located. Airstrike R. Orb Mint. Anybody else with the whole wind? Nope. Alright. Not right now. Can I use skills here? I don't remember. You know what I mean? Can we possibly... Yes, I can. All right. Wait, what? This climbing? Okay. I didn't know it was gonna be this early on. Yeah, ain't nobody got time to watch the <laughs> climb very slowly up. We have the advantage. Gale! Second form? Gale! It's down! Million, Push. let's go! You got it! Sit! Sit! My and turn. That's three down. Here I go! Ha! Now! Yeah! Are you really? <laughs> you bastard! I'm up! Sit! Alright, nice work. Thank you. A uh, bo yeah. full box right there. Our chance! And again, use Gale. Second form. Get now! An uh, opening! This. I'm up! Get laser! My turn. Yeah. Battle complete. Let's continue. Altina is very close to six. Gonna hit it anytime yeah. soon? Probably not. Ooh, fishing bait, all right. There. So there's two places I can go. I'll check over here first. There. Yeah. No, you don't. We have the advantage. All right, Gale. Second form, Gale! I'm up. Get lasered! It broke! An opening! I 
shall go. Leonic. Leonic. Fire. Woohoo! Oh, you can heal yourself and buff yourself as well. There! It's well, my that's turn. Nice. Press and slash. Get back! <laughs> Ooh, a link ability. I shall Thanks. go. Leonac obviously will not do anything. I'll give him a heal. Oh, so she's an AOE healer. Okay. Good to know. Yeah. Ooh, woohoo! Ooh, hello. Can I? Dang it. Megaton press. Yeah, that's Wind what hammer. I want. Critical. Let's go. Ha! It's down. An opening. And we win. <laughs> that was perfect. Altina's level Stats six. updated. Hell yeah. And what's oh in here? Oh boy, it's a treasure chest. Silver earring. And anything that I need. Ahem. Don't know why I keep going past the clip. Uh, power of Goddess Aldios? Oh, it prevents poison. Oh, that's the case. Give it to Altina. Don't need a healer getting poisoned. They noticed us. Enemy found. Begin suppression. Gale. I'm not gonna do it. I wanna I wanna use my seventh blade style, but I'm not. Second form, Gale! Wow, Vayne, now! thanks for missing all of that. Million, but... let's go! Okay! Yeah! There! Woohoo! Valiant Cannon. Get lasered! And there's three left. I shall go. Rionak? Rionak, I fire! Ha ha! Make a ton press. Hey, really? Sledge impact. Glammy hammer! Cobweb! Yahoo! How and about that? there was a triple kill, we win. Oh, th this is pretty tough. Are you doing all right? Yes, yeah, so I have no particular problems. Yep, yeah, I mean tip top shape too. You and Tilly are here, so I'm having loads of fun. Fun. Uh -huh, I guess it's all things still means me huh? Uh, well, I don't know if I'd say it quite like that. But you two being here is a big help. To be honest, I'm surprised you two are so in sync during battle. Uh -huh, well, we are pretty much sisters. Actually, it makes sense that we are able to synchronize so well. After all, our model numbers are one, only one digit off from each other. Black Rabbit, Altina. Model name OZ-74. Commencing operation. Whoa! Crazy! Yours is just one off mine! Let's do this, Lammy! Ah, the good old days. Milliam, Altina... I've known you two for a while now, and I think I was always aware of it to some extent. Huh? Instructor Reen? I know both of you came from the mysterious Black Workshop, 
Then, your memories of your time there were erased, and you were handed over to the Intelligence Division. I also know you somehow have the ability to synchronize with a combat shell. <laughs> and that we're technically not human? <sighs> Although he did not outright state it, he alluded to it multiple times. Pretty much. Indeed, we are homunculi, artificially created beings. But biologically speaking, we're pretty much the same as normal humans, you know? Hmm. But then, that doesn't explain why I haven't grown at all lately. Agreed. However, I believe I still have the potential to grow taller. <laughs> oh yeah? Well, I'm not gonna lose to you, Pipsqueak. I've known in the back of my mind for a while. And I've heard things here and there from each of them. Black Workshop, the group that betrayed the society and was taken in by him at the end of the Civil War. I tried to investigate it during all the missions the government had me go on, but I always came up empty-handed. These two have had their memories of their time there erased, and even Major Lecter doesn't know anything about it. Does he, or does he, is he lying? Why in the world did they create Milliam and Altina? Hello, Milliam Doreen! Come in, Reen. Come on. What are you zoning out for? I mean, they could have had some very big purpose for creating the both of them. Maybe to take over the world or as powerful sacrifices for some being that we have yet to see. Are you feeling unwell? If so, we should take a short break. Oh, don't worry. I'm fine. Milliam, Altina, no matter what else happens, you're both still you. Hmm? <laughs> well, yeah, duh. <laughs> but thanks. <laughs> I, I didn't say anything you need to thank me for. If we loiter here too much longer, it will affect the test results. If there are no problems, let us continue onward. Yeah, you're right. Alrighty then, let's go, go, go! All right, let's go. Anything in here? Yeah. No. Yeah. Oof, I actually kind of need to heal. Wish I would actually remember correctly of how to do it. Okay, so she doesn't technically have a full ability to heal, unless it's in combat. I don't know why it closes me out of Thalus every single time I use it. Whatever. Okay, so there's a ladder going up, but what's over here? Eh. Is this the correct way or is this the wrong there. way? No, you don't. Our chance to attack. Gale. Second form. Gale! It's down! Million, let's go! You got Six. this! My turn. Yeah, Burio Nak. Brionac, fire! Target's eliminated. Move out. GG? Eh. Give me this. Yellow hair. Wait, what? So is it actually literally, um... I'm up! I'm up! Is this actually gonna be yellow hair for Milliam? Costume, Milliam. Whoa. Okay, this is this is way too weird. Seeing Milliam with yellow hair like this, she's gone Super Saiyan. Oh, even her eye colors changed to match her hair color. So her original hair color turns into her eye color and vice versa with her hair. I don't know how I like this, man. A yellow hair, I guess I'll stick with it for a little bit? Maybe? Oh man, if this is how this looks with Millie, I can only imagine what Veen's red hair would look like. Our chance to attack! 
Who knows? It might actually look decent. Second form. Gale! It's down! An opening! Now. No, let's do that. Brionac. Brionac, fire! Here I go! Sledge impact. Lammy hammer! Top lamb! Ha <laughs> <laughs> I'm up! And... Now. I'm up! Sick! All right, nice work. That's so weird. I don't think I'm gonna get used to that. Wait. So are we going the correct way or the wrong way? Oh crap, this is the correct way. No. I didn't want to go the correct way. Well, this sucks. Man, her hair even Let's stays do in it, the... Lanny. I wonder if her hair is going to be the exact same color right now, yellow, in cutscenes. That'd be kind Clear of neat. Fire. I'm up! That also won't feel right, but still. Second form, now! An opening! Here I go! In Valiant Cannon. Get lasered! Now. It's my turn! Woohoo! Ha! Now. Battle complete. Let's continue. All right, we made it through. Huh. Okay, Tilly. If you're tired, just let your big say snow. I'll give you a piggyback ride. No, thank you. Did you please stop treating me as your little sister? But you are my little sister, aren't you? My model number is OZ73 and you're 74, right? That is why. Since I'm a new, newer model, my specs are superior. You should treat me with more respect. Oh, no you didn't. Out of curiosity, the OZ in your model numbers. I don't suppose you know what it means, do you? Nope, sorry. It's just a number we remember when we were shipped off. When your dad found you, you only remembered your name, right? It's kind of like that. Yeah, true. All I can remember was my name. I also remember being able to speak normally, and I had all the knowledge an average five-year-old would. But no matter how hard I try, I can't remember anything before that. <laughs> I guess I'm no different from you two after all. Yep, yep. Now that you think about it, I too had basic knowledge when I first worked under Lord Rufus two years ago. I was briefed on a situation about the various powers at work, and then went undercover assisting the Noble Alliance. You see, how about you, Milliam? Now when I woke up five years ago, Graham's clear and licked him while there. How does it feel to be awake, Milliam O'Ryan? I welcome you as the newest member of the Ironbloods. Your first task will be to learn from the others. I need to go on a mission right away, like Tilly did. I studied for a while first. Then I guess Claire and Lecter were kind of like my tutors. I see. Since she's an Ironblood, I suppose her situation would be pretty different from Altina's. Scarecrow is one thing. How did you turn out with such a personality stunning under the icy maiden? I don't think my personality really changed much at all since I woke up. But Claire and Lecter tell me I've changed a bit recently. I see. Um, is everyone alright? You didn't get hurt, did you? Oh, sorry, we were- no, we were just talking. <laughs> Stop chat to chat during a trial. It's certainly relax now, aren't you? If you've had enough of a break, then get moving. Uh, whoopsie, we got in trouble. Sheesh, alright, let's keep going. You've come pretty far, but don't let you go down, you too. Roger, Dodger. Understood. Although my basic specs are more up to date, it seems there's a difference in experience between us. However, I cannot allow myself to lag behind her in battle. I believe I should test the craft with Clomsilius soon. Oh? Test the craft, huh? Ha! Alright, beat up that box. 
We need to go, we need to go all the way back. Okay, if I can con control it. Jesus, holy hell. <laughs> so what's up here? A chest. A Got bunch of stuff huh? Let's hop back down. Okay, so you know, I think I might actually end the episode here. Might. I might just end the recording, then I might tack on another recording to this, give or take. So yeah, if I do it in the episode, th thank you guys so much for watching. See you guys next one. We will finish the rest of the trial and possibly go on the beginning of our first exercise out on the field of battle. And then who knows? We might actually be able to grind legitimately, at least for cash. That'd be fun. <laughs> gotcha. This will be the final battle we do in our crap amount of CP. No. <sighs> That's bad. I shall go. Real knock. Real knock. Fire. I'm up. Sledge impact. Wait, what? Wait, what? You... Oh, I can't land on top of him. Let me I have have a place to land. Cobweb! It broke! We let's do this! Leave it to yeah. the ship! Yeah! And GG. Whew. Everyone okay? There we go. Reen's level nine. Million. All right, nine. got it. What's in the chest? Oh boy, it's a treasure chest. Quest art. All right. So until then, see you guys later. Or in which case, I will be right back. So where was I going? That was the chest. My turn. Whoops. No, yeah, whatever. Yeah, okay, I got that chest, so we were going down. Yeah. No, you don't. We have the advantage. Megaton press. Get him, Lammy! Go! Got him! Assist. An opening! Let's go! Gale. Second form, it's down! An it's opening! It. Now. Uh. I shall go. I need to get uh. the CP up Let's as go. high as we can. Yeah. Alright, nice work. Oh, Milliam's almost nine. Not bad. Alright, here's the lock system. Now the shutters are finally open. You're almost there, everyone! Huh? What's wrong, Professor? There! <sighs> Nothing. Just concentrate on the trial. I mean, What's that, going on? That is what we are doing. So yeah, we came in from that side. The shutters were here, and then yeah, we went around. Alright. Wow, we were that close to the end. I feel a strange energy coming from this device. You should, should. It's a special type of orbit charging station. It'll come in handy. There's a special orbit charging station here. You can store your HP and EP, enhance your weapons, and create an enhanced quartz. You can also find super special orbit charging stations in some places, which offer various shop functions on top of everything else. So what you're saying is that I need to pay attention to the possible shops that are here. Well, either way, rest. And now, synthesize? Customize. So, yeah, I have none of these. 
Nothing at all. All right. Exchange? I can accept my, exchange my Sceptic for Mira. I don't think Mass is used for anything, right? Yeah, I don't think Mass is used for much. If I remember correctly, I'm probably wrong. I have no new gear, so yeah. Let's save the game after using the charging station right there. And let's go fight this boss. A dead end. I guess this is the end of the trial. Well, we made it. It was pretty fun, but I expected something from old man Schmidt to have a little more kick to it, you know? Uh, please don't bring that up. Wait, fall back you too. Here it comes. The heck is this thing? Zuo, a tyrant beast. What the hell is a tyrant beast? Well, what the heck is that? I knew it. P -p Professor, what are you doing? The monster isn't meant for level one. Huh. I'm simply giving them the kick they didn't ask for. Rabbit should be able to handle an enemy of this caliber. Ch I swear. It's comparable in strength to the magic knight before. This might be a good target to try it out on. He's gonna take it head on, right, Dream? My thoughts exactly. Don't hold anything back, either of you. This one's strong. Be careful. Oh, it definitely is. Altina can now use the S-Craft Arcadius gear. Ooh, that sounds nice. <laughs> now, it's hold my on. turn. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Order. I've been forgetting about these. Damage increase. Defense. Hmm. Yeah, Raging Fire. Let's go! Raging fire formation! Let's go! I can't do any more orders. And I need 100 CP for that, so just attack. Sit! It's down! Assist. An opening! Woohoo! Terror Breaker. She cannot use her S break right now, which actually kind of sucks. Oh, that she has 53 CP. Yeah. That's why. My turn. Altina, Arcadius gear. Now transform. Ooh, nice. Sync complete. Go, Arcadius gear. Oh. Ready, launch. That's a nice freaking. Uh, Brianna, open right fire. Exterminating target. Huh? Strength depleted. I'm sorry. Let's go. Okay, Altina went down. <laughs> um, Queen? Thalys? Wait, can Thalys survive? Yeah, revives when ally and heals a small amount. Yes, please. Arcus, activate! Ha! Thank you. So he heals a, s a small amount, did it say? Yeah. That just freaking revived out uh, her full this health. Is bad. Let's and go. Milliam's gone now. So now we gotta revive Arcus, Milliam. activate! Mean's not gonna get to do much at all. My turn. Wait, hold on. How much health does this fool have? I mean, hey, her S craft did a lot of damage, it's just. Nowhere near what I would like. Either way, now analyze first, making it easier to unbalance them, huh? Search mode activate. Scan complete. Lined. It's pretty much based of all around the board. Anything can unbalance it. 
Yeah. Okay. So the highest damage you can do to it is wind. Ha! When isn't it great that I don't think I have wind? <laughs> Thanks. My turn. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Wait, that's its ta targeting circle, right? It's my turn. Um yeah. Crimson Slash. Crimson Slash! Now! Flash. Million, let's go! Okay! Yeah! yeah. <laughs> I'm up! Ultimate Bear, create silver barrier granting immunity to one attack. Yeah, needle shot. Nothing. Yeah! That's basic attack. I shall go. Nothing on S crafts. Soul blur. Emits a space time shaking. Nightmare. Confusion. No supports. So attack normally. Yeah. And it got off Venom Flame. <laughs> Strength depleted. I'm sorry. Oh, I can still fight. Bayless. Uh, ah. Sorry, everyone. Well, crap. Here it's me. <laughs> so is eight. Oh, crap. You actually did have a heal. Are you kidding me? Okay, item. Do I have any revival items? Reviving Balm. On Reen. Yeah. Thanks. It's uh, it's bad that I have to use a reviving item right now. Not on my watch. And link oh. back ability activated. It would have took Here million out. All right, Earth Pulse. Here I go. It's my turn. Mean. Heal up our please. I need to spread out. Uh, uh, this is bad. Yeah. Wait, Thank you. That, that's a critical revive. Are you kidding me? Sorry, everyone. My turn. Oh. I think I might be better off just ending yeah. it here and then coming back and spreading out more. Thanks. Strength depleted. I'm sorry. I can't lose. I can't lose. <sighs> yeah. Yep, it can't get to us because Altina Thank and you. Milliam are blocking the way. <laughs> sorry. Depleted. Well, sorry. never mind, we lost anyways. <laughs> oh, we lost on the first actual boss. Wow, I forgot that you can weaken enemies and retry the fight. Why the hell would I do that? This one's I just strong. keep playing Be this careful. terribly because, again, I don't like the the fighting system in this one. It's my turn. And I need to spread our units out. Crimson Slash! I'm up! So, go over here. Now. Altina, you can stay somewhat technically close to me. Bionak. Arcadius Gear. Now, transform. Sink and complete. She. Ready, launch. Bionak, open fire. Exterminating target. Huh? Ah. Still such sweet looking ability. I like it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. Up. Now, ultimate barrier, S craft. Arts, Earth Pulse, Here Altina. It's my turn. Crimson Slash. Crimson Slash! There! Thank you. Ha! <laughs> 
It's my turn. Okay. Payless. Lilium. Woohoo! Lilium. Valiant Cannon. Get lasered! Got him! Rush! We must do this! Got it! Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> Thanks! <laughs> and down depleted. goes Altina. I'm sorry. Let's go! Payless on Altina. Uh, yeah! Thank hey, you. it actually got off. Here we right. go! Valiant Cannon. Get lasered! It broke! An opening! Strength depleted. Boy, just I'm sorry. Stop it! I can still fight! See, this, this is the problem. Thank you for dodging. I can still fight. Yes, you can still fight. Arc now revive Altina. Ha! Thank you. Woohoo! God dang, man. Ultimate barrier, create silver barrier, granting immunity to one attack. Let Put on me yourself. <laughs> Thanks. Useless. Sorry, everyone. And down goes Woohoo! green. Obviously. Item, reviving bomb. He is out of... <laughs> of course he's out of range. Because why wouldn't he be out of range? Ha! I shall go. Uh, item, reviving bomb on Reen. <laughs> and of course then she runs to him to use it. Thanks! Oh, would you stop it? Now. Just stop it. I have no one that's crap that I can use. Could have sworn if she had. Uh... Yeah, it was this one. Odgum Heal. Go down there. Now. Item! Tia! On yourself! Yeah! Here I go! Ultimate berry on Let yourself, Milia! <laughs> I can hey. still fight! Item! Tia! On yourself! Ha! Let's go! Attack! Sit. My turn. Order. You know, I it's bad when I completely forgot about the whole order system, even though I used it on the first time trying this. Form a iron will formation. I need defensive stance My turn. instead of attack damage. That will definitely help a lot more. Attack. <laughs> His shield's down. Yeah! It broke! Rush! We must do this! Got it! Yeah. Let's go! And he's got it back. Of course he does. Sit! Now! An opening! Now! Alright, now Milium, I want you to use Tira Balm on, on yourself. There! Oh. <laughs> Let's go! Thank you for the link ability. Ah. Woohoo! Ha! <laughs> I shall go. There! Iron Will is gone. It's my turn! Put up Forma. Iron Will again. Iron Will formation! Let's go! Sit. It's down! Uh, Alright. 
Delay plus 15, Megaton press. Actually, no. 97, attack Milliam. And Let's she's go. got it. Terror Breaker. Lim, double up! Change! Here he comes! Yeah! Terror Breaker! Nicely I'm done. Up. Payless. A million. Arcus, activate. My turn. Altina. Artigam heal. On both you and Rain. I'll support. Thanks. Arjun yeah. heal. Arjun heal. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> I'm up. You prick. Arcus, heal activate. Altina. <laughs> Thank you. I shall go. Freonac. Freonac, at fire. Let's go. Oh, you have it. All right. Seven slash, fallen leaves. My blade, calm as still water. Now. Flash! Fallen leaves! <laughs> All right. <laughs> Through yoga howl. Not on my watch! Thanks for the link ability. Here I go! Iron will. Forma! Iron will formation! I'm up! All right. Attack. Yeah. I shall go. Arjim heal. I'll support. Arjim heal. Thanks. <laughs> hey, poison Millium all you want, man. That's not gonna stop us. I'm up. Are you doing it to the ring? Kind of, kind of hurts a bit. Crimson slash. Crimson slash. Woohoo! Ultimate barrier. Lemmy barrier. <laughs> Thanks. Idiot. My turn. I guard it against that for a reason. Arjim heal again. I'll support. Thanks. Arjim heal. Here I go. Yeah, normally, it's my turn. Crimson slash. Crimson slash. Got to million all you want, man. I'm up. You're not gonna be able to actually beat her. Especially not if I use Thales on her again. Uh, Here I go! Ha! Yeah! <laughs> My turn. And Brionac. Brionac, activate. Fire. Let's go! Okay, so wait, what level are you? Oh, Jesus, it's level 10. No wonder I'm having such a hard time with this crap. Obviously, fire would technically do a decent amount, but I need wind for its ultimate weakness. Firebolt. That is delayed, but it should be a crit or the next person gets a crit. Whatever. Sit! You're gone. Whew. Everyone okay? It took me 13 minutes and 32 seconds. Wow. Okay then. <laughs> Whoopee! Stats updated. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna need to grind. That was ridiculous. Enemy subdued. Woohoo! We climbed it good. Man, Tilly, that was amazing. Yeah, those were totally different crafts than you were using last year. Well, I am the latest model after all. It simply took me some time to fully apply my higher specs in battle. Uh huh, that's so, huh? Well, either way, you did great. William, uh, uh got luck. Glum Celeste, good job to you too. Uh huh, no problem being a Reno. Oh, 
it seems like you're all okay. Barely. That was good to- good. I suppose that's it for today's test. I'll be at the entrance, don't make me wait. Oh, Professor, um, please be careful on your way back, everyone. That man. I'm starting to get tired. We should follow his instructions to go back. Yeah, might as well. Not oh, fine, I'll give me a piggyback right on our way. I'd rather you didn't. Oh my god, that was a it's ridiculous my turn. battle. Woohoo! My turn. Uh, um. Yes, save the game. Very much so. Alright, time to get out. Professor Smith and Tina should be waiting at the entrance. Aw oh, man, I can't believe it's already over. If we haven't forgotten to do anything, then let's head out now. I've already looted every single chest here, so let's go. And these guys barely give me experience. Let alone anything I could possibly sell for some cash. <laughs> 